Hello students and welcome to the online platform of our school. Here is your English teacher Himlata Bath to provide you online classes and today I am going to teach about chapter number 13 what happened before. So the topic is about what happened before. So students we divide time even we measure time by three points. You know we tell about present, we tell about past and we tell about future also. So time is divided into three parts. Present, past and future. So present means what is happening now or the everyday topic like I go to school every day. Hmm? So this is also about present when I tell something about before so the time is said in the past okay so the time is about past what I did what happened before and when I say something that will happen that will happen that I will go I will eat I will do, I will study. So when I tell you something about happening next, so the time will be said in future. So as I told you, time is divided into three parts. Number one is present, number two past and number three future. So students, in this chapter, I will discuss you about past. So what happened before? It means what happened before. Before means past. Okay. So students, now you read the sentences with me. I like ice creams and candies. The nation hopes for a better leader. Ashima cooks wonderful pasta. He is learning lots of money. He is earning lots of money. I am moving a heavy box. So the verbs in the color, in color, show that the actions take place or are taking place now. So these sentences are about present. Right? Now you read these sentences with me. I liked ice cream as a child. The nation hoped for a better leader. Ashima cooked wonderful pasta. I earned more than me. He earned more than me. I moved a heavy box. So the verbs in color show that the actions took place before the present time. What are the words in color? Liked, hoped, cooked, earned, moved. These are the verbs okay, that are in red color. So, these verbs tell us about the actions that happened before, that have not happened at present, that have happened before. It means about past. So, students, you have to study some tables also. You know, we generally add D or ED to the verbs when we talk about, about past, when we talk about past. So, if... I say about present, I will say like or I am going, he is learning and when I tell you about some past, then I will change the action words. But how? By adding D or ED. Okay. So I liked, you can see L-I-K-E-D. At the last, I have added D here. Hoped. H-O-P-E-D. Hope spelling H-O-P-E, hope. And here. At the last, I have added D only. Cooked. C-O-O-K-E-D. The spelling of cook is C-O-O-K. I have added E-D here. So students, it is really confusing where to add D or where to add E-D. Right? So now you study this table. Like, it is in the present and it is in the past form. Like has become liked. Hope. Hoped, baked, baked, move, moved. So, 
what do you understand by this table we understand this we understand that if the last letter, letter is e if the last letter is e we will not add ed we will add only d okay so l i k e d last letter is already e so we will not add ed more we will add only d at the last okay then the action words will say something about past it means what happened before clear we add d to the verb to show that the action took place before now so students this is the shortcut method to learn or to understand where to add d or where to add ed okay so if the last letter is e you will add only d read these sentences mohit and rohit and mohit talk to their teacher every day could you please repair the watch mother will stitch the torn garment to mend it okay the workers paint the walls before they move the furniture in we walk to school in the morning and now you read the sentences rohit and mohit talk to their teacher about the class timings arun repaired the leak in the pipes the tailor stitched all our clothes tom sat as his friends painted the fence they walked cautiously so that they did not fall the verbs in color show that the actions took place at some time before now right these sentences are telling us about past it means what happened before look at the action words or verbs talked repaired stitched painted walked here ed 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 extra ed has been added to the last of the words so these action words are past these are about past okay so for these we have to study one more table where to add ed we have known that if the last letter is e we will add only d okay but now the last letter is not e so we have to add ed so this column is for the present time and this column is about past time talk becomes talked in the past time repair repaired stitch stitched paint painted walk walked okay so we add ed to some verbs to show that the actions took place before now so students you have to keep in mind that when the last letter is e you will add only d and when there is not e at the last you will add ed okay so now we will try to solve some exercise okay so your confusion will be very clearer choose the correct word last night i play or played last night means about past not about present last night so definitely the answer is played chess with my sister we watch or watched an animation an animation film last evening last evening it means also not about present it means about past so we will use ed form of the action word okay because ch last letter is not e so we have to add ed so watched my parents love or loved gardening my parents love gardening students i also told you when the sentence tell us about everyday topics everyday terms then we have to use the present form of the action word love not loved it is the past form and it is the present form my brother and i clean or cleaned our room yesterday yesterday also tells us about past so cleaned in this way we will solve this exercise okay now move to page 81 add ed or d to these verbs need n e e d last letter not e e is not here so we will add ed needed n n e e d ed needed okay pick picked p i c k e d save saved you can see the last letter is already e so we will add only d okay saved similarly in the case of dance danced d a n c e d okay last letter is already e brush brushed b r u s h e d because 
there is not e in the last letter right so in this way you have to complete this exercise here we have a small story we have to identify the incorrect verbs okay then write them correctly in your notebook then you will write them write the story in your copy so what is the story we have to identify the incorrect verbs and then we will how will we identify them you will encircle them okay one morning a merchant loaded so it is wrong here answer is loaded his donkey with sacks of salt to go to the market they had not walked so it is also wrong walked very far when they reached this is also wrong reached a river accidentally the donkey slipped and fell into the river when it came out of the river it noticed so it is also wrong here noticed that the sacks of salt loaded on its back had become lighter then what happened in the story so the merchant returned home it means about past so he returned home not returned so it is also error here and loaded some more sacks of salt on the donkey's back when they reached it is also wrong the slippery river bank the donkey fell into the river again this time on purpose okay so it is on purpose thus the salt was gone again by now the merchant knew the donkey's trick okay he wanted so he wanted as it is a story the story i am telling you a story so it is about past okay he wanted to teach the donkey a lesson as he returned home the second time he loaded bags of sponges on its back they set out on their trip to the market a third time on reaching the river the donkey very cleverly fell into the river water again but the load became heavier because the sponges were filled with water so here only this is the error fill answer is filled with water okay so students this is the story and here i have encircled the error i have identified the error okay you have to correct them then you will write the whole story in your copy so students this video ends here hope you have enjoyed and understood this section thank you